So we had a firmware upgrade on this camera to version 1 to 1 and I'm going to show quick how the HDR function looks like and where we find this. So we can scroll over here, swipe it, noise reduction, compensation, HDR rendering, that's what it is. And let me take a quick picture to show how long this takes. Okay, 23 seconds roughly. And for you guys who want to see what else this can do here, the, the app, I mean, if you buy the camera, then you need to use an app like this. Otherwise, it doesn't really make sense. And so, but if you want to see it before you buy this, how the um, app looks like, what there's for buttons in there. Here's the shutter priority, ISO priority, you can scroll through there and do different ISO settings. Then the manual settings over you do that and here are we back to automatic. Then we have a setting here. What can you do in the settings? You click on the image size, you can change to a smaller version. You can turn on the interval, how many pictures you take, and in what interval. And yeah. Basically, that's how this app looks like.